we're going to talk about in this lesson how to add points into your job if you're not going to transfer those directly from AutoCAD into the data collector. And if you do want to transfer from AutoCAD to the data collector, we'll cover that in another lesson. But for right now, if you want to type these in manually or enter these in manually, you need to go under Job under Edit Points. Now there's an insert option down here at the bottom and if you click that you'll be able to add one. So right now it's going to add point 101. You can enter in a description, specify the layer, and if you go down here under location you can also highlight that and your keypad will come up and you can specify a coordinate. Now remember that this is northing and easting. It might be a little bit different than the format you're used to using the HPCC coordinate geometry software or AutoCAD where the easting shows up first. Just keep in mind what your northing and easting are and where they're positioned. So I'm going to type in 7,000 and then over here I'm going to type in 2,000 and I'm going to click on my screen and I'm going to leave my elevation at zero. Now one of the things you need to remember when you're transferring elevations from this data collector back into AutoCAD that if you transfer it using the methods that we're going to propose in the future that it also transfers in at the specified elevation and you could get errors if you transfer points in that do have an elevation so I'm going to specify mine at zero. And then also if you have geodetic coordinates you can enter those in as well but once you're done I can hit the check mark and that entered in point 101 and that's an example of how to enter in coordinates into this data collector.